And look at that just slowly drain. Welcome back to GWG, where today I'm draining us out so we can build ourselves a lumber axe. And I have the copper and tin required. And I guess, yeah, those are done. And I want a whole bunch of bronze, because I could make a whole bunch of different tools out of it. I wouldn't I can't upgrade the shervel. Shrivel's fine as it is with iron, I'll toss a diamond on that. But with the bronze axe, the broadhead axe, the lumber axe, that will be really nice to start chopping trees down. I get a tree farm going and I have to go to sleep. So what I'm going to do is, I think it's... Oh, okay, let's do it. This is why I like having this for. QD smeltering, use the molten tin. What do we use the molten tin for? Alloying, we need one to three. 16, 32, yeah, so one to three. So one, two, three, one, two, three, and then three, and then nine, and then three. And hopefully that'll work out. So I'm gonna go to sleep and we're gonna see if this works. Hopefully it does. If not, I've got more copper to toss in. We'll see how it equivalizes. Equivalizes isn't a word. All right, so first I wanna get the tough tool rod. And this has a 1.4 modifier. So the already huge durability we'll get out of the ax head we're gonna get out of this. So bam, we have that. Now I think I need something for the plate. And the plate usually is for modifiers, although it adds a lot of durability to the ax. But I don't need any modifiers. I don't need many modifiers. So let's just go straight. Do you want, let's, let's go with this. Green and brown, why not? Durability of 512. Sure, let's take it. And I don't need to repair it with Peridot, so it's just it's just there to look nice. So let's just toss these back. I know people who are like applied energistics are screaming right now, but I don't care. <laughs> I feel like if I use applied energistics, I will never use chests again, which people are like, that's the point! But, uh, you know, I, I like my chests too much. So it's... Oh, I made an axe head, didn't I? Alright, well, Broadhead Axe. I'm pretty sure I've got, yep, it was one to three. So let's see how much I have left. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And then if I do one, two, three, four, we'll have all the bronze we need. So this takes up eight, so slowly fill this up. And then I'm gonna slap an ingot down so we could get that. So this will equalize the nine. I don't know how many different sets of nine we can do. Whoop. Oh no, I'm clicking all over the place. There we go. Awesome! So now we have that. We have 30. Did I miscalculate? I think I did. For it to be 9, it needs to be 63. 36. My math is off. Whatever. I'll figure it out once it gets low. So we have the axe head, the large plate... We have the tough rod, and now we need something to bind it all together. And I think I'll go straight up cobblestone. And the reason why is because it will give it the stonebound modifier, which means the more damaged it is, the faster it works. And it does that on the terra cracker. You can see at the bottom, I, I tried pointing with my finger. But uh, it adds extra mining speed. So now that I'm going to repair this, if I repair this, it's going to go down, which I will. But it's the side benefit of using this. So right now it's got 10.34 with a bonus of 1.59. But if I repair it, it goes down. Simple. But I still get a nice little mod modifier off of that. So if I want to build the lumber axe, I need that. I need that that and I need that we'll just uh, call it the tree feller just because I have nothing else better to call it <laughs> all right so now we've got this oh guys I don't know but if you if you play games and you realize you get this overpowered weapon and you're holding it in your hands like oh I feel like a boss you know how I feel Watch this. Bam. <laughs> oh, 
Oh boy, it feels so good! Oh, look at all this. Let's see how much wood we picked up. One, we're good on saplings. We are solid on saplings. We will not need saplings in the near future. And all of that wood? Almost two stacks. And I swung, what, three or four times? Let's go over the Sakura Blossoms over here and we're just going to annihilate those SOBs too. Because sometimes it's annoying getting these large trees, isn't it? I swear it increases sapling drop chance because you don't get this many saplings off of a tree sometimes. Ah, oh, guys, it just feels so good. Pop. And there we go. And this is why I love this mod. And how much durability does it have? Its effective durability is 3,152, but its total is 2,837. Bronze has reinforced, which is pretty much unbreaking one. Oh, boy. And uh, we get... Sure, it's a low mining speed, but it's not like we only need to mine a whole bunch. And uh, the max... And we get a bonus off of it, too. So, man, does it feel good just tearing through things. I'm going to get this dark oak, and hopefully it gives us more saplings. I see five. Six. Six? Did I see six? Oh, that goes. Oh, that must have just narrowly dodged the explosion when the uh, bottom of that was being created. So, I have no room. <laughs> Alright, let's fix. Let's quickly fix the situation. You, all in here, because this is where you can go. Come on. Now we got more dark oak now, which is great. I put the other stuff in here. I think we should toss that in here. And these I'll put these in here just to remind myself to get those later. But man, how much does this attack too? I think this... It won't tell me the attack. Oh, plus two attack damage. So it's not very good for attack. But it's good for felling them trees. And I see a tree over there we haven't gotten yet and loaded up into our little tree space. So let's go do that right now. Alright, so what might you be? Eucalyptus. Oh, that feels so good. To, oh, you almost look like your birch trees. The pink wood. Oh, that's that's super pink. Okay, uh, I don't like you. <laughs> but screw it, I could use you for chests and stuff that I don't want to use other things for. There's always a use for something in Minecraft. You just have to find it. Now I got all those saplings, so I guess that'll be good for doing the uh, trees farm. I'm gonna do a small little tree farm, get like a couple of each up there. It's just, ah oh man, like. Pop. Ooh! Berry gardens! I'll take those. Walnut? I can make a tree out of that. There's a nice little area here. I'm gonna let that continue to be. Oh, they got cotton there too for string. I don't need any string right now, but. Whoa! Whoa! Hole. Good. Now all we need to do is just continue on our way. So, bam, we got something that we need done, which was this. Oh my god, having having this is just so much better. We're going to grab... I threw those, but either way, we still got them. So I'm going to keep on popping some... Oh, yeah, we're doing this. So we're going to toss these right over here. One, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. And then afterwards, we'll get some more. Oh, man, it's just... Having some things like that is just so much fun. Once you get this lumber axe, it's... You just feel powerful holding it, you know? When you could take down a huge tree, I'm not going to attempt those. I know this could probably try to tackle it, but I'm not going to, because these are from the same mod makers. But... Ah oh, man, get that rubber wood. As soon as it detects that there's a tree there, it'll start to take it down. And ah oh, man, clearing this out is going to be a breeze. And maybe I should make the excavator because if I want to flatten this out, I'm going to need to have some uh, good tools. The thing is, I can make the excavator out of stone because I don't really need to use a lot of it. That I just keep the repairing it with cobblestone. Whereas this, I need to keep on repairing it with 
Which we'll call it. I did keep preparing it with bronze. The forest hive. This is gonna make people angry and upset. I don't need this forest hive. I do not like using forestry. We might do it at a later date, but it's not like forest hives are rare. Watch that be one that contains like a rare queen or something like that. That'd be hilarious. Oh, people would be so upset. <laughs> Watch me get famous on the YouTube. They come back to this one channel and be like, Unsub for queen abuse. Oh, man. It's like, you know the tree feller mod? It's like we permanently have that on. Ah, oh, just suck up all this good, delicious wood. Ah, oh, God, it feels so nice. All right, guys, so we have the smeltery set up. We've got these hills, things I want to tear down. We might tear down. I'm actually go over there. But it'd be nice if we could flatten that area out. We've got some nice little areas here to build in, and especially over there. I wouldn't mind uh, taking down some of those acacia trees. And I think that we are good for today. I might do a bonus video where it just shows me tearing down a good chunk of this place, but it depends. I definitely need some more chests. I might make a chest hut so we can start doing iron chests or anything like that. I might fill these things in. I said I might not, but it looks like I am. I'm going to have to tear down all of these trees, flatten the area, and build it up for a tree farm. So, guys, hopefully you're having a great day. Leave a like, comment, and all that fun stuff. And I'll get back to you guys. All right, see you later. Bye.